I think we're live right now. We're live. I see it up there. I, I see it up there at, at least. Good morning, afternoon, or evening. What is up? My name is Marta. Welcome to this live stream, actually. Um, because, well, as the title already says, um, my phone took a dive in the ocean, or in the sea, actually, because it's not on ocean, it's not open water. And uh, that means that it's the uh, end of the vlog. No, I'm just kidding. Um, about the part of ending the vlog. I will not end the vlog. I do not want to end the vlog. I want to continue the vlog every single day. So yeah, let me check, by the way, if my uh, audio is working correctly. Yep, but we do not want the new reverb right now. Uh, so yeah, let's close this for a second so we have a little bit of a better connection also because I can see myself on the TV here as well. And I'm right now gonna wait for some people actually to join because I have no idea how many people actually joined this chat already. I know it was online at uh, 8.30, and I know it's going to be recorded and then also, again, uploaded on the channel. So, yeah, got my little biscuit shirt on today. Did not have to look a little bit re representable for the vlog. Anyway, let's see what I can do here. Learn more about uh, turn guests volume up, down, or eject any bad actors. Nah, I'm fine by that. We'll just... All right, I adjusted all your audio levels and everything's working. So yeah, now I'm just wondering if there's anybody with any questions right now. That's the light, light seems okay. A little bit from one side, but cannot help that too much to be honest because well, I've got three viewers actually. Now I know this, now I notice that there are three viewers. If you want to say anything, just please leave it in the chat. There's like a 30 second delay or something, especially with Greece. It can take way, way longer. So it's a little bit weird because usually I'm already walking in the street like, hello, hello, what's up, you know, vlogging in the streets. In this case, I am sitting here on my own, looking at myself, actually, that's even worse. Um, uh, Emre. Finally, yes, I know you. You subscribed recently, and I checked out your gaming uh, channel recently as well. I do not understand anything from your games, to be honest. I'm sorry. I do like playing games, but I'm more into like the Call of Duty kind of games and GTA V. I was a very strong GTA addict, to be honest. <sighs> Wait, I, I missed Shane. I missed Roald. I missed my mom right now. Okay, that's actually cool. I'm very excited about this. So we're waiting for Ilona because it is right now. Almost a quarter to 10, and Ilona's working in this kind of period always until late, a lot of times. So I'm just sitting here with you guys, waiting for your questions. With my Greek frappe. Hola, Roald, dude. And now, the funny thing is that Shane is a subscriber from like almost from the beginning already, one of the first ones. And, uh, I call him Shane because he's, his subscriber name is Shane, and I actually know his real name, but my mom is saying kisses. Or is it it's worse to do mine? Or is IT is worse? I do not understand anything from that. Sorry, Yum. Or is it is worse to mine? I don't know. Let me close the door, by the way, because I'm sure that the dog is going to bark outside in a second. For everybody that's interested, actually, today was uh, greetings back to Athens. Today was uh, one of the first really like summery days again, to be honest, here in Polis, I think. It has been sunny the last days, and it has been raining as well, but today was really a warm 30 degrees day again, and I really got sweaty and nasty and sticky and all that, and Ilona got back home, so. Hello, Ilona. Hello, Cat already had food, so. We've got we've got all again. We've got my mom. We've got Hello. seven viewers, it's like a mountain of viewers. I'm gonna die. You're gonna die. Yes. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Ilona, uh, all the same. Ilona. Hello. Hi, to me. Emma, have you ever think of moving to the USA? Actually, we did. We have thought about moving to Canada. To Canada, to be honest. Oh. Yeah. Hi. 
We have actually thought about maybe moving one time to Canada, but we do not. We're not being able to uh, uh, actually emigrate to uh, emigrate to Canada because we we do not add up with all our ideas that we want to do. So yeah, we don't deserve it. Hi, Clementina. We do not deserve it exactly. Yeah, that, that's a horrible thing. So yeah, I, w I wish actually I have thought a lot of times about moving to Canada or maybe the U.S. But the state that the U.S. is in right now, I'm not completely sure. I'm very happy here in Greece with Ilona right now, and I also have my family in the Netherlands. So moving outside of Europe would be a great step. Oh, that's fine. Amber also says you, you can read that. Oh. Hey. <laughs> Hello. Ilona has a little bit of a difficult, hard time sometimes with reading on TV because it's too small. I just came home after I don't know working. Three hours of work. Yeah. That's not three hours. It's morning. Okay. I don't see anything right now. What do you know? It's crazy see? busy. And it's very warm in Greece. It is very warm. And outside. Because I was just telling about the fact that it was today the first day of summer again. And uh, no, it's, yeah, okay. It's the first of June. So it's also to you, all you guys, Kalomina. Kalomina. It's, uh, Kalomina, that's what you say in Greece Sorry. if you have a new month. Where are you going? It's that hot. Thing, so again, uh, yeah. But. Also, by the way, Emre, I'm Dutch, so I, I came from the Netherlands already to Greece first, and that was a big step. That's about that's a little over three years ago right now. And the fact is that I'm still enjoying this a lot, actually. I'm still enjoying it. It is not the easiest way, of course, but to be honest, where is it? Galomina. Ah. Sit down, Emre. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, so also, uh, I did not announce this uh, this live stream so much up front because sadly enough I wanted to do this uh, live stream on Sunday before the guys actually come or on Monday maybe and then plan it up words up front and tell you all about it in the vlog but as I said my phone took a dive in the sea and uh, no at all that means that I do not have a phone right now I do have a very a very old one actually with that but this camera is not sufficient for the vlogs to be honest so and this is my Dutch number so if Anybody even still needs to reach me, they can always reach me on my Dutch number. Um, but it's also difficult. Like for example, yesterday I wanted, to, I had, I was being called by an ex-client actually that wanted to ask something about renting a boat, and he had to call Ilona. Luckily, he had Ilona's number as well. So, uh, yeah. The fact is, I'll show you. The fact is that I took my phone apart for the first time in my life, yeah. and it's not something that I would do every day. So this is the phone that I do the vlogs with. It's a little bit uh, spotty right now because I've been touching the screen all the time. But I opened the back, and this is where the battery use should be. And then here should be the motherboard always. But I even took out the camera. And then it's drying because I cleaned it with uh, isopropyl alcohol. And right here we've got the motherboard. This is the... the Front of the motherboard with the, the back of the memory, uh, the back of the motherboard with the memory cards and everything here, the memory in there, and then you've got the front of it. And I've been brushing it very carefully with 99.9% uh, .9 alcohol, and it seems to work. It did clean a lot of corrosion and salt off, and it does turn on. So I was very happy about that. But the only negative is that my screen doesn't turn on. So maybe, and, and the touch screen does not reply. So maybe it is in the in the connection. I don't want to bore you guys with it, only if you're interested. Um, I, I have been thinking of, uh, because my parents also said maybe I should do a fundraiser, because, well, like I said, it's not the easiest thing here in Greece, and I really love doing this vlog, and I really want to put my energy in there. Uh, yeah. I don't know if I want to do it in my phone. No, Ilona has exactly the same phone, and we did record some stuff, so tomorrow we will upload uh, some sort of a vlog just with the story about the phone again and I do have some footage still on this phone that I really want to get off also the moment when it fell into the sea so I did go to a repair store today but the guy was such an asshole to be honest sorry for my words um, that I did not want to have my phone fixed there and he was like yeah I'm not sure if I could fix it and a little bit negative about the fact that I want to buy alcohol and want to do it myself in the, in the first place yeah because this way you will not fix it then. I know, I, I take away his money. Well, then he should sell alcohol, shouldn't he? Anyway, long story short, uh, 
We, by the way, you don't need a ghetto neighborhood here to fix your phone. You just go to a repair store. I mean, it's not like in the Netherlands where you have like Turkish or Chinese stores where they fix your phone in some like alleyway sometimes. Yeah, they're a little bit shady stores in, in my opinion always. Mm -hmm. um, but here, the, well, the Greeks are shady in some cases, <laughs> to be honest. Yeah. But it's dry right now. And uh, what else? Yeah. I'm Any questions, by the way? Because, okay, the, the, the thing is, the thing is that I wanted to do this live stream again, uh, a little bit more announced so that everybody could like think of a question that he wants to. I always ask at the end of the vlog, like, leave a question down below or uh, let me know what you want to see in the vlog because for me that's also very important. I know in which direction I want to go with the vlogs. It's a little bit of daily life and especially the life of Greece. But I also want to show a little bit more of the area and the people and the stores and stuff like that. So in the future. When you get your phone fixed? If, yeah, when my phone or gets when fixed. when you get a new camera? It's not about getting a new camera. I was saving money already for a time to come out buying a new camera. Yeah, okay. If anybody knows anybody with a decent DSLR, for example, or mirrorless, let me know because that's that's something that I'm looking for. Something that shoots like 60 frames per second and has a 1080p uh, quality at least, like 20 megapixels. Anyway, yeah. Well, what else? I'm, I'm I'm gonna have a sip of my coffee. How was your day? It was very busy, very nice. It was crazy. I had to be at the store. My two bosses, both of my bosses, were there. They were there, yeah. They were there, yeah. Uh, they were both there, and we had the three plans each. It was crazy. And we had people waiting for us outside of the store. Mm. Summer is a busy season for us in our work. So yeah. It's always like that. That's also, now, that's also what I told already that, that you're always busy in this, at this moment, especially. Yeah. That's Ah, we've got our girl from the Dotrak and our friend online as well. <laughs> <laughs> it is nice to do it like this, actually. Uh, but we don't have video. What do you mean? We don't see anybody else. No, we that's this is, this is a Google Hangout. So it's a simple Hangout uh, live stream. I could do it like with a broadcasting thing that I could like pop up things here and pop up things there and right here, put something on your face. And, uh, <laughs> Like this? Yeah, like that. That was nice. <laughs> and uh, yeah, but it was a little bit a lot of work, and it's also Ilona's laptop, so the half is in Greek and half is in English. Wait. You live in Greece, you know. Di Natale. Di Natale, ha ha. Anyway, yeah. What else can I tell? Actually, how did it happen with my phone? Well, yesterday we had a, ah, oh, yeah, I, I know what, what I want to say. Right now we're using, uh, very simply, very simply, we're using Ilona's new webcam, our new laptop. And it, in my opinion, it's a decent webcam for a laptop. Uh, it's very noisy right now because we have, um, first of all, a low connection here. And second of all, it is dark in here. I tried to light it up with a lamp. So maybe if it's a little bit brighter, it will be better. Um, I could not hear you from downstairs. Okay. No, but I closed the door also because it's gone. But the fact is that um, we wanted to go just for a swim. And we went for a swim. Nice it was a very nice day. Yeah, it was in late, late evening actually that we went. And uh, <laughs> I saw a chicken swim. The chicken was crossing the road. You have roads of water. Water roads. That's actually possible. It's impossible. It's after that. It's a Greek word, right? Oh no, it's an Latin word. It's a Latin word. Anyway, ADD. Hey, bird. Um, so yeah, and we just laid down. I wanted to make some nice shots, and I think we took a nice swim already. We go yeah, the in. So the, nice. Yeah, the weather really right now is really nice here. And then you want to take a nice shot. Ilona laying down because she was like this, and then I put my tripod down, which was. Very stable, in my opinion, near a piece of concrete. So if it would fall, then at least my screen would smash or something. I don't know, whatever. Sadly enough, it slid a little bit through, and then it like dropped all the way into the salt old, uh, salt sea. And yeah. And then I see somebody standing above me, and he was like, 
Yeah, that was the end of my fault. Yeah, it was really, I, I was so much flabbergasted about, I was so much amazed by the fact of what happened that I'm like. Mm. I didn't understand what happened actually because you were just standing there with your selfie stick, with your selfie stick wet, which is always wet because you're putting it. Yeah, I, water I, I put the tripod in the water. I'm, 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 I use my phone. I mean, like if I want to get a good shot, I don't mind putting a tripod all the way underwater because it's just a tripod for like four years to change. But this is how a phone is supposed to look like. Yeah, my phone looks exactly the same. <laughs> Not even close to. There, I know there are a lot of good webcams to be honest. Um, my phone, Charlie, was for me that time it was not that expensive then, but now it got more and more expensive to me. Like I don't know, mentally maybe a little bit more because not right now it's it's a Samsung Galaxy Note 3, so it's now still worth around like 150, 200 dollars uh, euros if you still have a decent one. Mine would still right now make 50 euros. But at the time, it was over 700 euros, 800. It was like what you pay right now for an S8. So, yeah. We do not watch no. Survivor. <laughs> Actually, I did watch. The, I do watch the trending bits. For example, uh, for the people that do not know what Survivor is, Survivor is right now very, very big in Greece. Every like from I don't know, seven year old until older, they everybody watches Survivor here. It's a series where they have to do challenges to each other on a very nice remote island and everybody's nice and tanned and muscular and far older. Um, but there was a very nice video yesterday actually that we watched or today with the, with the Turks and, uh, and the Greeks together when they were having dinner. It was very, very nice to be honest. So yeah, but to get back on the camera and on the phone, well, I could show you again for the people that just showed up. So this is the this is the motherboard that I took out and I've been cleaning the couple of days, and this is the back of the phone and you might actually be able to see all the corrosion in there. There's like these gray areas here. They're more white right now because of the corrosion in there. You can see around the edges all corrosion. <sighs> Cannot do anything about it anymore. Cleaned it. It works now. It's just all about the screen. Uh, next. Camera should be a DSLR so we can like, take good footage. Really good footage. Hmm? Good for you. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, Marcia from Pewsie. You look like Marcia. Well, maybe she she sounds a little bit like Marcia. Marcia is the girlfriend of PewDiePie. She does very much like me. So no, I don't. <laughs> I don't sound like her. No, she's, I think, no. No, Matt is Italian. She's also brown and brown. Brown like that hair. Yeah, and Matt is a very pretty girl. Um, Thank you. <laughs> yeah. So that, that's um, that's that's for the phone, uh, camera, whatever. And then yesterday we went home immediately after the beach force because I was feeling so bad about this phone. I was so amazed, like it fell in the water. It turned off. Uh, so we went home. We dropped it in rice, stuff like that. And then we cooked rice. <laughs> yeah, and, then after, and that evening we also ate rice. So be glad about that part. We did not film the eating this time. Uh, yeah. Summer vacation. Huh? Roll, roll. Uh, I, I know for a fact that Marcia is not faking her voice, to be honest. Uh, Ilona's voice is also high pitched. I know girls that have a high pitched voice like that. She is uh, maybe exaggerating her accent a little bit. Summer vacation is a very, very difficult thing because, as I said before, um, at my work we start the season now, and until late December, I can say, we're very, very busy. So we don't have free time. I would take just five days now that we spend our time here. Yeah. Just to have some free time with them, but that's all. So by Tuesday, I want to have something that I can record with. We, because yeah. on Tuesday, we're going to have uh, Dutch friends coming over. And they already sent a package today that I picked up as well, which I really was bummed about that I couldn't vlog it. But Il Ilona recorded a little bit, so you'll see it tomorrow in the vlog. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we got tasty <laughs> stuff. So they sent the Dutch guys actually sent uh, stroopwafels, which is which Dutch. It's a Dutch cookie. No, we still have one. You just ate the last one. No, I didn't. There's only one. You ate one. I ate two. You ate the rest of the four. Oh. Anyway. <laughs> Ilona loves stroop waffles. It's a very nice and syrupy Dutch yes. waffle cookie. Then we have we also received a 
big, big pot of uh, peanut, butter. peanut butter. Yeah, and I, okay, sorry, I already ate half of it. Uh, You're on a diet. I know, but I'm going to work out also right now. And we received a half a slug, which is also a, a Dutch a chocolate sprinkles, and it's super tasty on bread, and we eat it, and I'm crazy about that kind of stuff. That's the only thing that I might actually miss in Greece, uh, except for croquette fricandella. It's like fried sausage. Um, we, we have a, what are you doing? We have a fly inside the house. But you'll see it all tomorrow in the vlog, what we received. And um, yeah, I think it's a compliment in both cases if I look like Jacksepticeye or PewDiePie, because you have said both times that Jacksepticeye. Yeah, well, now it's not that green anymore. You said he had something very friendly over it. So. Very friendly, yes. I never said that I would say something. Top of the morning, chill, Alice. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> um, bro fist. I know all the, so don't get me wrong. I'm really a YouTube addict. I love YouTube. Since 2006, I've got this channel, and I'm actually really now doing something with it. So, uh, yeah. Now, as Shane of bro also said it. Top of the morning, chill, <laughs> Punched it like button in the face, like a boss, and high fives all around. And thank you guys. Okay, that's enough. But hit the like button if you like it. But um, I'm on so this. Okay. Teach Ilona some Dutch word. Well, I can teach you. Oh, take it easy. I get that one. It sounds funny. She likes to swear in Dutch. I like to swear in Dutch. My name is Martin. <laughs> my name, my name is Ilona. My it's name been, is Martin. It's been uh, how old? Twenty-eight. Um, I think eighteen. 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 Uh, so that's the Dutch that we can. That's enough. That we so can give bottles you. is perfect for me. I might actually still do a Dutch vlog in the future, but again, like on Tuesday, you're gonna hear. So that's gonna be Wednesday if I upload it, of course, and if I have a camera, I hope so. <sighs> Whatever you believe in. Um, My name is Jeff. The thing is that I mm -hmm. hope that I have a camera back then, by then and we can actually film because we're going, uh, Maria, that's actually what you asked also, where are we going uh, for vacations? We live right now in Volos, so most of the times we spend our time on Pelion. If we go to Ilona's parents, we go to Nausa, and to be honest, Nausa is also amazing if you want to cool down a little bit because you've got a nice park and you've got the, the water sources and oh my god, it, it, is, it is really good to go there. And otherwise, we visit Pelion. We're going to take the train on Pelion. There's a little uh, a diesel train. It used to be a steam train. We're going to take a trip with that. We're going to visit some churches. We're going to visit some beaches. Actually, every day we're, we'll visit a beach, to be honest. We're going to get tanned. We're going to get tanned, finally. <laughs> yeah, so that's what, we're up, that's what we're going to be up to the next uh, six, seven days, actually. Um, and then they are going to go back to Thessaloniki. And after that, they're going to go back to the Netherlands. So, it's got just going to be a week. I think actually it started raining a little bit again. We got our we got our weather back. It has been raining the last few days. <sighs> Thanks everybody for watching. By the way, uh, we've got nine viewers. It's not much, but I'm used to these kind of months. I love the one-on-one -on -one almost feeling to it. So uh, yeah, I think. Uh, Charlie writes, Ilona's skin looks yes. pure white milk. I don't like that. <laughs> I like it actually. It's too white. No, it's not, it's it's okay if it all like that. Ain't, that ain't nice. That <laughs> isn't nice, you would say, by the way. And uh, the fact is that, yeah. It, first of all, it's the lighting. I'm also very pale right now. I can do it like this, but I think it's a little bit boring to be honest. So we keep this on. <laughs> Ilona is from origin from Georgia, so. So I was supposed to be dark. No, but you have very dark hair and very dark eyes, and you have yeah. like a very bright skin. Yeah, but the, in Russia they have bright skin. Why? They're white and they're blonde. Well, in Georgia, then you explain why you have pale skin. Because my grandma when I don't know. Everybody in my family, family has blue eyes or green eyes with the dark hair color, skin color. I'm the only one like this. I'm Dutch and I'm browner than her. <laughs> 
Yeah. So yeah, give me a little whatever. Give me a little hey in the in this in the comments if you're watching. I know we have six subscribers. I only see Charlie and, and Roll like spamming the chat. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Yeah. Again, what do you let me know also what you think about maybe doing a fundraiser? Uh, just like not an Indiegogo campaign or whatever, but I want to give something back to you guys if you would be able to fund me, for example. You know, so uh, I already have these stupid advertisings everywhere in between. I did not do any advertising during this live stream. I would not want to. I just want to have a little bit private time with you guys right now. It is. 10 o'clock. It is 3 to 10. 3 to 10. And I want to make this, this live stream at least like an hour long. So whatever you can like later watch back, you can just click through and whatever part you like. I'm not going to do the highlight stuff. This is just a very nice live stream to see uh, you guys somehow in the chat, you know? Um, da. Privyat Ilona, minya zavut roal kandila. Well, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and now we're being cool. Now you can also hear it. Say it. Now you can speak Russian. Yep. Yeah. Are you watching? My grandma is watching and she does not understand. We're just sitting on the couch. So this is like real life right now because every <laughs> evening when the vlog is uploaded, her grandma and her mom, actually the entire family, and she like calls to Russia and says like, hey, listen up, uh, my my uh, granddaughter, she's making it, they have a vlog online, and you should forget to check it out, push the like button, and they can subscribe. So I think like 50 subscribers at least are from Russia. It does not add up in the analytics, I do not see it, but we've got from Canada, from the United States, from Germany, we've got from Greece, from Netherlands. So yeah. I don't know why she's laughing. It's very annoying. But Sorry, but do you also want to laugh? watching and she's like, yeah, I see, but I see you talking on the phone, but you talk to me? Because no, you're not. Okay. <laughs> so the funny thing is still that her grandma is also like on, on yeah. YouTube and on it's Skype really and all that kind of stuff. So uh, yeah. Sorry. Questions, come on, questions, whatever you want to ask me, whatever. It's not a QA, and a it's an A&A. &A. So if you want to do like anything and answer. What's A&A? Yeah, I don't know, someone said it one time, A&A, &A. Mm -hmm. uh, anything, answer. Answer anything, that's what it is. It's an answer anything, A-A. Ilona uh, she This year she became Kennedy. And I also, her mom is also still alive. 96, 7, 97. 97. 97. So Ilona has a great grandmother who is 97. My grandmother is 94, probably right now. She's, yes, yeah, she's 94. And then we've got her grandmother who is, huh? did you say your mother is 70? And your mom? Uh, 45. 45. So decent young mother, actually, if you've got a daughter who's 28, turn it 28. And I'm turning 30 this year, people. Wait, I'm getting old. Up. I'm getting, getting so old. 76. Nice. That's a nice age as well. I think 76 is a very nice age because you're still in that moment that you're still a little bit more active, maybe. I like the number. 76. 76. Yeah, it reminds me of a race car somehow. I don't know why. What's the what's the number of uh, of McQueen of the anim animated racing car? I think his number is also 76. Yeah, I don't know. Do I watch other YouTubers? Look, to be honest, PewDiePie, I do not watch him that much because uh, I like his older content, the, the, the games that he used to play, and when he got really scared, when he was like shouting. Uh, he's the blonde Swedish guy. YouTuber, and yeah, to be honest, I not a not a big fan of him anymore. He also grew, outgrew the rest of YouTube. To be honest, I'm a big fan of of Casey Neistat of his work. Um, I used to watch, and that's also the video that was uploaded yesterday, I used to watch a lot of uh, Shay Tart. Uh, sadly enough, that was kind of controversial because Shay Carl did something that he should not have done while he has five kids. Um, so, But I still like to watch some old videos of them. I do watch the Dutch YouTuber Enzo Knoll. Uh, I do like his uh, positivity, just like Roman Atwood. Um, who else? That's, yeah, Casey, yeah, of course, but, oh yeah, and uh, Shondurs, I actually, 
like sometimes have Twitter contact as well with uh, Sean Durs, and that's very cool because he just hit one million. And then we watch, of course, like uh, Panagiot Rafael because he's here in Greece with us as well. He just hit 1.2 thousand, wait, no, 1,200 subscribers. And Tech It Serious, yeah, that's uh, the other channel that I had a coffee with the other day. And they gave me the gimbal, yeah, also, yeah. So I, I do watch all kinds of stuff. I like to watch a lot of DIY as well, but they don't upload like every single day, and that's the problem. So, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Charlie. I have 35, and you love 25? This is the first time actually someone estimated me older because I I'm always being estimated that. young. Do you watch my video? Good game blogger. I don't like that guy. He speaks too much. <laughs> I like I like how uh, the, the the funny thing is though that for example Roman Edwards um, when I watch his uh, shows for example he's got 12 million subscribers if you're at that point you, you you don't have any like contact with your subscribers anymore yes you know that people love you and yes you get to hear every single day like I'm your favorite fan or whatever I'm your biggest fan I watch all your videos but yeah at a at a moment you start like getting more hate as well because I don't know, people are getting jealous and stuff like that. I mean, that guy worked his ass off and got lucky in a lot of ways as well because, I mean, I upload more consistently than he does, but <sighs> Emre, it's very hard to, do, to not do that, to be honest. But I will not say it out loud, so somehow I didn't. What? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> don't stress the religious. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. So that's it, Laura. Yeah, tell me not to do something, I'll do it in Sunday. Exactly. So no, I'm I'm third. I'm I'm hitting thirty this year. Twenty-six of June. Days. You have pictures when you were kids. Uh, not right here, right now, because the pictures that I, when I was a baby, I actually have them still in the Netherlands with my parents. Um, you do. For you? No, nah, and I don't think it's gonna be that visible on the PC. I do have my grandma here. Oh, that's not my grandma, that's my passed away cat, who should be still living because he didn't get that old. He got hit by a car in the Netherlands. Then we've got my grandma here with my dad. Uh, we've got Ilona. Then we've got my entire family in the back here. Then we've got Ilona's cousin. We've got Mark here, one of my best buddies. That's me, my butt, when I was still having a good shape. Mm -hmm. uh, then we've got my three other good Greek friends from, uh, from my study. Then we've got George and Ilona and Mariana. Which is coming tomorrow, George? George ah, yeah, George is going to come yep. tomorrow, but probably, again, you'll not be able to see that in the vlog. I think you we'll see. We'll edit in the vlog. We'll make sure that we have another video on uh, what they will be then Saturday. Yeah. And maybe then we'll do another live stream to fill something up if I do not have a uh, yeah, cat hit by a car. Yeah. To be honest, here in Greece, it happens a lot of times that you yeah. because we have a lot of big issue here with street cats, and we do love cats, but you cannot adopt them all. It's just a thing that they don't like castrate or sterilize them. So that's or the they take them when they're like hungry and sweet and nice and fluffy, and then they just you see like uh, you see a lot of nice and fluffy cats yeah. and dogs, puppies. They buy puppies, and then when they get big, they get they're, they're being put somewhere outside of the of the city to protect uh, an area. It's a very sad story, and I don't want to make it too sad here. So. I almost forgot the, mo the most two important girls next to Ilona and my mom in my life. I mean, these are my two sisters. You don't see them that well, but you probably see them in the vlogs. I asked them actually to do an intro one time as well. Yeah. What? We do have a video. Yeah, tomorrow actually we're going to add in a little video that came from one of my best buddies here from Greece. He lives now in Austria, and he's going to do the little intro actually from Amsterdam. Um, no, it's not really an intro, but it is an intro for me. Okay, sure. And uh, yeah, so those are my sorry, those here, not there, there. They're my sisters. It's an old picture from a uh, from the open air museum. Yeah, you shouldn't touch my armpits <laughs> when it's thirty two degrees. Karma. If I have a dog, I will name it Karma. Hey, tell me a joke. A joke. It, that's funny also. Yeah. Today, actually, I heard a very good one. It's from uh, Philip Koebel. He's a Belgian guy. And he was at a TV show, and they said, like, have you ever been to Africa? And he's like, 
Mm, yes, I've been to Africa. And did you like it? Yes, I did like it. But what did you see? A lot of things. Can you name five African animals? There four lions and one giraffe. And I just, I love it. It was the way that he, that he said it, like four. Anyway. Another good joke, by the way, where um, there's a vlog that I called, uh, He Made Her Cry, where Panagiot Bye bye. See you. Night night, Emre. See you. It is also turning night here, to be honest. Emre, where are you from, by the way? I didn't check it out. Are you from the, from the States? No, you're not from the States. I wonder where it comes from. I have to wait also because it's a little bit like, uh, well, it's really outside of the gym. Four lions and one, uh, whatever. Giraffe, elephant. I didn't hear a lot of good jokes lately, actually. No. Anyway, five viewers. We're, uh, it's getting lonely here. I wonder who's watching. I wonder if my mom is still watching. Giraffe. Ilona was kicking her own her own laptop. We're still we're still gonna work out after this, by the way. We can also do a live stream with working out, and we're all gonna work out together if you'd like to. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, we'll, I, okay. So, five more viewers. What else? Maybe we can teach you some Greek. Hmm. No, it's too difficult. It's fine when you hear people we can talk to each other. We can, I don't know, like what you did today. We can do it like this. Oh, uh, what do you do? What kind of job do you do at all? We can do it like this. Come on, come on. And how was it? Without, he wrote without. Come on, we can do this. I screwed up. <laughs> anyway, so that's a little bit of life. Um, I wanted to show more stuff, actually. Where's the cat? Uh, it didn't show Durak. I did. Patty Pat. Yeah, Patty Pat. Oh, here's Durak. Hello, Durak. Come on. Oh. Hugo. I know Hugo. No. So, for the ones who do not know who this is, oh. No, 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 no. He's We're a not. very sleepy, angry Durak. He's a little bit angry right now because I woke him up and he was very much chilly. Like look at this belly. Look how flat it is. Look, look. <laughs> He's biting me. I don't care. He's biting me. Look at this stupid monster. Stupid monster. Anyway, that's Durak. And he's uh, shedding a lot right now. He's losing all his hair, sadly enough. Yeah. Look, don't throw the stuff in the floor here. He loves fidget spinners, by the way. Where are my fidget spinners? Where are the fidget spinners? I have no idea where I love the fidget spinners. <laughs> Does it get triggered? Uh, I don't know. In what way should my cat get triggered from seeing the dead? I don't know. It's a picture. I mean, it's not a real dead cat. <laughs> He does not mind the mirrors. He does not mind the um, video. What? I'm talking. Don't yeah, interrupt now, me. Also, sometimes when you're like having a normal conversation with someone, he wants attention. He starts like sitting next to you, and he's like, meow, 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 all the time. Today, I actually went to a store like that, uh, Roald. I went to Practica because I want to build something. Sadly enough, not in vlog, but I'll show you later what I built. I didn't do it. Really? No, no, oh. no because they didn't have the stuff. I went to Practica. It's a store like Kubo. It's a DIY store. Why didn't you go here? Because it was closed. Mm -hmm. So it until 2 o'clock. That's also a weird thing in Greece, that it's not like a lot of other countries where they work from 9 to 5, or just the entire day from 9 to 9, some stores actually. But they work from 8.30 or 9 until 2 o'clock, and then again at 5 until 9, which is very annoying sometimes, because other stores do it from 8 until 3. It depends on the, where you work, what kind of I know, or if you work in a factory, it is even uh, earlier sometimes. If shifts, when it's wait, yeah, okay, we give shifts everywhere. Mm -hmm. if, you, if you work, uh, yeah, if you work at the store, then you work the hours that you said, but on Monday and Wednesday and Saturday, you have your evening free. Mm -hmm. You work half day. I think, because at all the saying now, you want to know how many colleagues I have? 
I guess you have, okay, if you work at a small Hubo, it can be that you have around 10 colleagues. But if you work at, if you count all the Hubo stores in the country, I think you have over a couple of thousand colleagues actually. So I don't, I don't know exactly what you, uh, how many colleagues you have. Charlie, I have to check out your channel to like find out. Oh, I cannot watch. I have to check out your channel to find out how old you are because I cannot see any of your pictures. Oh my god, really? I've got a spammer, nice. Um, no curve is flat, I know, is no globe, is NASA Australian, is no debt, is no slave banking, is no NDWO, is peace not war, is enough for everyone, it's cancer prevention, don't talk about that, it's can the center of everything, it's possible creator, is please research. Big Johnson, I will do my best to get into that. Uh, I don't know. The thing is that I do. Uh, I have a very strong opinion always about everything, and I've learned here in Greece to take it a little bit more easy with that because in the Netherlands I was way more easy, way more like blah, throwing it out there. And I've noticed that it's not that much accepted here in Greece if you just throw out your opinion in a lot of cases. So yeah. Cool. We've got uh, 22 viewers and we've got spam. I don't mind because it's all going to be advertising. Sorry if you uh, think it's not cool anymore. I'm sorry. Someone found our uh, Hangout, our live stream. The Matrix has us. That's cool. Thumbs up. Thank you. Sorry, Shane. Probably I will not be able to read any comments anymore <laughs> because the chat is now going crazy about the Earth is flat. And uh, that's cool. How flat is the Earth in centimeters, please? <laughs> <laughs> it's funny to see that it's going in. Spam level, yeah, God. Spam level, God. Come on, hit me. Because it's not, it's not me that you're, that, that people are annoying me with. <sighs> luckily, <laughs> luckily, I recognize profile pictures, so I pick out the correct ones. We love you too. We love you too. Yeah, the Earth is flat. Greece is very hilly, though. The funny th fact is that uh, if you tell a Greek that the highest point in the Netherlands is, uh, oh, is yeah, only 300. 300 meters, or a little over 300 meters in the Netherlands, then, and, then any Greek would be like, what? That's, that's not even a mountain. That's a hill. How can you come up with something that is just a hill? I'm like, yeah, that's it. I mean, why not, you know? So, uh, yeah, but it's very funny. How high is Olympus? How high is Olympus? Like a kilometer or something? So the entire area is very like bouncy. You know, by the way, ask us a question. Uh, I ask you a question. Who wants to sponsor me by getting a new phone? Someone said that in the comments. Ask us a question. Will you sponsor me? 2,918 meters. Wow. So almost three kilometers high. That's That's... Olympus, that's the biggest mountain here in Greece, right? And the highest point in the Netherlands is 300 meters. So <laughs> how flat do you want the Earth to be? As flat as a fidget hey, hey, spinner? That's mine, isn't it? I know, here, grab it. Um, sad thing is, though, I do, not, I do not see any more the comments come by of the, the, the subscribers. That's a little bit sad. So, Roald, Charlie, Maria, um, I didn't see George come by. That's okay. Get binoculars. Marta, it is flat. I know, Maurice, it is super flat. It is super flat. But the Earth is not. It's okay, though. I recognize your little pink S. So uh, mm -hmm. the nice thing is that I can recognize your comments in between. It's nice, actually, to read the comments because there, there are some nice people in between as well. I've, I've actually looked I looked up a video of people still believing that the fact that the Earth is flat and that when they when they sent uh, people into space and everything that they still uh, made other kind of pictures sent other kind of pictures uh, to make people believe that the Earth is round. But still, an airplane I don't know. Now there's a cutter with telemetric. I do not know anything about that. There's a Facebook page. The ball is round. 
the ball is round, so why is the aerosols and research this? Mm -hmm. Fake space, no, it's not. We can do. Well, am I am I like getting trending on on the Reddit or whatever? Hit it up on Reddit. My <laughs> this live stream. Then I will sit here for a while and then just cut out the rest in the end of the of the whatever. Right. Okay. No workout today. <laughs> no workout now. Oh. We're just gonna sit here and uh, the read people say something as uh, where did I do not know Shane. Uh, somehow because uh, I have the entire live stream set up freely to open for everybody and it's on YouTube. People can just look up and they say all together, like, let's go there. And they spam with messages. And I actually think there are machines as well that use that for spamming. So, but in this case, uh, you do not spin. You do not spin. I do spin. It's mine, five year old. I'm not spinning, I'm just spinning with it. It's my toy. I can even put it like this. Look. I do wonder, though, like, uh, if all these people that are in the right now, thanks, Marta. Later, later, Maurice. Um, the funny thing is that they are all leaving also right now again. So it was really a little trending thingy, and they just, I don't care. They're real good girl. Thank you. <laughs> flat horizon and picture behind you. I know, super flat. So I, if, if it's a, that flat, how do you? Un no, never mind. See, that's the thing with me. I want to get into it again as well. <laughs> I want to like reply again to those people as well. Check out the all-seeing eye, people. Check out the all-seeing eye. Global exit. Globe exit. That's a good idea, actually. We, I think we should leave uh, Earth and uh, just create a huge ship and leave like Noah's Ark. I do not believe in Noah's Ark, but it was a nice story. <laughs> yeah, just a huge spaceship, like that movie that we saw the other day. What was it again? With uh, um, the one that they were asleep. The same like Wally, you know, where everybody gets fat on board and they just come back to Earth later to find out that it's uh, so nasty, you know. I do I do not want to read any part of the Bible anymore. Sorry, we're trying to enlighten the mess that we think flat ocean water plus the global mode. Thank you, Donald. She may. She may. Nope. She marked. Is she October? <laughs> Research moon landing hoax. I've read about that, and I could actually understand that because the Americans want to be first again in something. So that's actually possible that the Russians were first on the moon, and then they made fake something with the flag and everything. But you can also think sometimes like, hmm. Whatever is more convenient for you, you can believe in that. That's that's something. Whatever is more convenient for you, you believe in that, and I, I'm totally fine with that. Don't harass someone else. As long else. as you're happy with it. As long, yeah, I'm happy with what I'm thinking. You think? I do think really? sometimes. Yeah. With keep, what? Yep. Yeah, keep spinning. Sorry, Sean. Oops. Oops. Keep spinning. Keep spinning. I will keep spinning. I like the chat now. I like it a lot. Flat Earth 2017 consciousness. I do not mind it at all because. I went from 160 viewers down to 22 again, and I hope to get back to my six viewers uh, a little <laughs> bit after that again. Thanks, Big Johnson. Have a great too. Have a great day too. Trusting your senses. My senses sense nothing right now. There is no curvature. And how do you explain when you twist a, bu a bucket of water, when you twist it very hard like this, how do you explain gravity? Because if it was flat, you still need a spinning force to have gravity, right? Uh, Why am I also spinning? Oh my god, that's like a disease. We, we, we stop, start taking that stuff. Also, how do you explain like the wormholes that created the gravitational uh, wave uh, the, uh, the last few days? Yeah, you to my channel. Thank you for the shout out. You're welcome. <laughs> do you know the clap? I love the clap. I love how crazy that guy is on this little Bertha. He's a little guy. <laughs> I don't know. He's he's like a real good upcoming YouTuber. That's a guy that I would really say like he's got comedy. He's got his balls like this big to just go up to a girl and say like, hey, you know that that wall is built in 1847 and it was laid brick by brick with these gloves that I'm wearing right now that are bought from 2006. Hey, Jimmy! That's a, that's a funny thing. So yeah, 
Ah, oh, that's the guy. Oh, okay, yeah. I like him. He's funny sometimes. He's a he's a very good he's a very cool uh, cool guy. I I have seen actually work I've actually seen a wormhole as well, uh, flat Earth. That was when there was like a little rainworm and it like dug down into the ground and it le it doesn't really leave a hole. That's the whole thing, you know. It doesn't leave a hole. That's that's also a black wormhole. <laughs> Whatever. It was not founded by the Nazis. The same for highways, the same for Volkswagen. Who cheated on their diesel stuff? Um, CERN, having a nice flat first visit. Why? I'm not intending to leave again. I do want to leave one time, but. Where to? Everything is a damn theory. Damn is with D A M N. Then what's the point of going to school? That's a good question because I don't think that you always need to go to school. It's only for your basic language stuff. It depends on why. Actually, oh, that now I see it, now I see Charlie again. Now I see that it's Charlie. Uh, the National Aeronautics is basic administration. First, let's acronym for Satan. If you believe in God, then there is a Satan. But all I will accept it as soon as I have my phone working again. <laughs> um no worm in fake space. I think you should try out fake space and try to breathe there. Okay. You can change it to whatever you want to, but don't do it in front of the live stream. Uh, I almost fell. Uh, yeah. Is there anything? What's your number one proof of the spinning ball? What's your proof? Um, I actually like these kind of conversations, don't get me wrong. So I, for the ones who don't, do not know yet, I'm a daily vlogger right now. I'm an interior designer here in Greece. I left the Netherlands. I left the Netherlands and I came to Greece to live here because life here is a little bit more uh, nice, sunnier, warmer, better. I'm not getting mind blown. Nah, I'm, I'm okay. I would like to have all these people right in front of me right now. That would be way cooler. School exists only to indoctrinate mass sheep. There is a little bit of truth in that, yes. At least people that know the truth that Earth is flat, don't go to school. Flat. Yeah, and the all seeing eye. 73 likes, thank you. <laughs> if you believe in God, you can believe in globe because the Big Bang Theory. The Big Bang Theory. That's one of the, the funny bazinga. Uh, so, yeah, if you know that reference, you also know the Big Bang Theory, of course. This would like a video for flat Earth, sakes and truth. The truth, though, what is the truth? That is a question you should ask. What is the truth? Because I don't know if you know the picture, but if I, um, if there is a picture of a cylinder, and if you have light from this side, it shows a, sh a shadow of a, of a uh, square, and if you show it from that side, it is a circle, the shadow. But in real life, it's a cylinder. So what is the truth then? So you have the flattest Earth and the flattest round. But maybe it's a triangle, the all seeing eye triangle. How do you like that trip, actually? Um, I'm not going to do any research right now because it's way too late for that kind of stuff. Schools are for kids to get slaves and work for all of them until you die. <coughs> He's a savage. See, if Earth, if Earth is flat, how do, you, do these straight lines also turn up to be curved? The boobs. Boobs, exactly. <laughs> so the earth is made of boobs. Charlie, Charlie, you're a savage. I thought Charlie was like, I don't know, 15 years old or something. I think life is crush your enemies, see them kneel before you and feel the element, the lamentation of their women. Ah, lemon, like lemming. We just want people like yourself to look into it. I don't have time to look at stuff, into stuff like that. I, I have my own life. I enjoy my life. I think that's way more important, to be honest. And as long as I enjoy it and don't follow the mass, then... In winter, you have time. Now we have two miles. We're busy with going to the beach. Unruly fellows, I fidget whenever I want to fidget. And it helps me with my ADD so I can read all your damn comments. <laughs> horizon means flat line, not curved. Uh, horizon is not flat. If you can see it with your own eyes, if you look over the ocean, you will see the curvature of the Earth. How do you explain that? Because your eyes are round, like a lens, but inside your iris is flat. Gravity has and will never be, be proven. Well, I'm not floating. 
Uh, I'm 11 and a half. Nice. Sharing is carrying. Thank you, Shane. <laughs> My question to you is, would you back me up if I did a fundraiser? I'm actually trying to save money for my, oh, that's what I said, yeah. Something like that. I'm actually trying to save money for a new PC. My laptop is crashing all the time, but I can I can miss some. Uh, to be honest, Shane, if you want me to help you with uh, with a laptop, I do not mind uh, to. There is there is on the, uh, what's the site again? Tweakers. There is a there is on the website Tweakers. There is a guy that sells very good secondhand uh, stuff. To be honest. Oh yeah, we got our PC. From we him. got our PC from him, and he very built good. it, and it's a very good price. So. Thumbs up, NASA lies. Yes, NASA lies. Thumbs up this video, please. Um, Freemasons. Oh, I can tell you a story about Freemasonry. There is a lot here, actually. It's everywhere. You know, the thing is that, uh, that if you start talking like about this kind of stuff to a Greek person, if a Greek person would see all these comments, they would totally completely freak out. Freak out turn yeah. off the PC right out of the window. Do they have kids? Do you, no way. Charlie asks, do they have kids? I, I assume that they are talking, but he is talking about us. Yeah, we have yeah. one fluffy. Well, with one, four very, legs. one very hairy, yeah, with four legs. Really? Do that. Or four paws. Get your butt here. Do that. Thanks for noticing, Nicholas. <laughs> Ilona, she doesn't think that I'm that much intelligent. He says, please, yeah. please just look into this. You seem very intelligent. Thanks for not ridiculing us. <laughs> I'm a little bit ridiculing you because you came all in here together, of course, for a reason. Um, I'll send you on Facebook, uh, Bo. Freemasons and Je Suisse run the world. Um, there is the, the people that run the banks that run the world. And to be honest, they don't run the world because you can still plant the seed and that seed will grow whatever you will do. Uh, you can throw as much asphalt on, 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 a, on a rainforest, but give it about 15 years and don't touch it and it will grab back. So there's not a, not a bank or another Freemason that can do anything about that. Or just poison the entire world what we're doing it right now but we're getting way too deep this was going to be a very nice like comfy what well, how are you doing yeah. we are not chattel slaves but slaves nonetheless and what are you doing in youtube chatting writing not making research right now and informing me in a live stream because you're all commenting on me 14 and a half and where are you from, Charlie? That's what I'm wondering from. Because it's, uh, your English is like half, I don't know, you're, I think you're Latin or something because of your last name. No, you're not Latin. I understand that right now. <laughs> you're here to spread something and look into CERN. Chemtrails, there is there. I am from, born in Amsterdam, so I did hear the story about chemtrails. Vaccines, there's also a story about that. By the way, I have an S3 nail laying around here with a fully broken screen, maybe. Thanks, Go. But right now, the fact is that uh, all this all this in here is working. Uh, the screen is also not functioning. So it's exactly like your S3, but thanks a lot for offering. My sister also offered me an A5, too. Uh, in small, vitamins also in a small amount are good for you. That's what also Philippines. Depends no. on what kind of vitamin. Yeah, because, because Nicola, Nicola says that uh, a small that vaccines contain a small uh, amount of formaldehyde and mercury, and that's true. Yeah, but that's uh, just like uh, vitamin, for example. If you overdose in vitamin C, you die as well, and you just need a little bit more of uh, uh, vitamin C to die from than formaldehyde or mercury. The best kind of slave is the ones who don't know they are, or the ones who don't care they are. You mean men? <laughs> <laughs> Women rule the world. <laughs> Show me dummy again. How many people are in the club room? Yes. Yeah, in ours. Yes, in ours. Yes, but in the, in the adult version? Yes. Yeah, I'm like going to stop fidgeting, fidgeting around. <sighs> Humans are slaves, yes and no. To a lot of things like technology, yes, we are slaves. 
I think it's I think it's nice that only the most important or the most smart people have stayed so far. At least people that are interesting. Thanks, Lavandas. That's why she's my girlfriend. Oh, I see. I don't see what's written there. <laughs> <laughs> she does it on purpose. <laughs> no, 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 not at all. We've got we've got a TV screen like in the back with all the comments going on. So creep. <laughs> <laughs> Charlie, you do you do not want to know what kind of messages I, I like count as spam sometimes. Um, can you pronounce uh, Shane's name correctly? But you mean like your nickname or your real name? Yeah. Say louder. Roald. 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 That's just too much. Like everything has to do here. It's too much like the, I don't know how to explain it. When you speak Greek, it comes more from the back of your mouth. Not that much of that. True, just like Dutch, so in some ways. The only thing, yeah, that's the only <coughs> You know what's also poison, by the way, Nicholas? <laughs> also poison is coffee. Because everybody thinks they need to drink it just like sugar. To stay awake and have energy. But you can live without it, but everybody takes it. That's what I think is a part of slavery. Because we're consuming all the time we need to consume anyway um, i'm getting into this again martin got it right but yeah says it's easy for dutch people my math book has committed suicide I too many consuming problems <laughs> um i wonder if your grandma's still watching i think so If anybody of your flat earth people want to help me uh, start uh, help me back up my fundraising to get a new camera, I'll be there. I'll hit you up first. Funny thing though that if, if there's over 120 people joining in one time in a chat, they'll leave it once again. And we, we let, we're left with 12 people. You're all, yeah, you almost hit his name. You almost said it. But a while. Well, right. as we already said, we can. We whenever you're here in Greece, we'll definitely go out for a, for a drink like that, or if you want to get something alcoholic, that's fine with me as well. <laughs> get or some cipro, or just swim. Yeah, of course. But that's the thing that you do in Greece, right? If it's good weather or ski. Yes. Ski. And from a 300 meter high. No, ski on a nice mountain, for example, that is like high and not flat. Did you see my face? No, I want to, damn, I want to Google it. But you know what, Charlie, at the moment that I want to Google your, like, uh, whatever, profile pic, then uh, these the flat earth people came in. I have no idea where you are. Can you send it me? Wait. YouTube. Where are you? You do. I cannot read any comments right now, though. Yeah, you can also read that. Actually, no, because the entire bit rate drops in. On a very low. Uh, What's the difference if you're looking there and I'm before I'm looking here? Because then we're both looking. No, I mean, if you just have that on and I just look from this. Because it's Who from said this you is from Wi Fi, that's from the network. Damn, I cannot see profile pictures. That's so annoying. Why? That's all right. It's not like that. Well, oh, I had it's like the square root of pi. Hmm. It's a very long. It's a very long math. What? Oh, yeah. Like he wrote no, actually. No, I would not accept somebody else if I did not do it before. <laughs> If you like, if you think that I'm a very sympathetic uh, guy or whatever, flat Earth people, hit me up in the, with that big ass subscribe button. I will do a live stream later again that you can spam all in. <laughs> Sorry, Charlie, I did not find your uh, profile so far. Just like you said, it's a square root of pi. Um, Where are you going to start? Nicolas is Greek. Above. I don't think so. 
You two are very cool. Have a good day and do not take a flutter playfully. Let the idea ripen little by little. Goodbye. <laughs> it has ripened all the way until it almost got rotten, to be honest. Sorry. Uh, See, I do not make I do not make fun of any theories because in some cases theories are very are, are theories and they can be very interesting actually. I mean, people believed one day that the Earth was flat and then they had to believe that the Earth was round and now it's the other way around again. And thanks, Nicholas. Uh, yeah. So, Will you at least consider looking into this before disclosing? Well, if you can hit everybody up to join this live stream again, I might consider it. Um, Nicholas, by the way, it's a Greek name, I think, right? Nicholas. It can also be Russian. It can also be. Yeah, it, it's a very common name, to be honest, actually. But in Greece, you, you hear it a lot of times. Not Nicholas. 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 Hmm. So, yeah, my name is very Dutch, Mark Junkin. Especially my last name, because my last name means young child in Dutch. It doesn't get much more Dutch but than that. But you're using all the things up in the day. Yeah. You have to change your last name. To old, to old man. Old, yeah. From young, from <laughs> young child to old man. Um, yeah. This live stream is called My Phone Took a Dive because I already told everybody else my phone took a dive and that's why it's drying and I cleaned it with rubbing alcohol. I wish the earth was flat. Uh, Thank you, Donald Putnam. That's a, a Indian last name, I think. That I've, I've seen that name one time, like Patsal Putnam. Putsal. Yeah, exactly. Martin, Martin, are you here? I am. Yeah. I am right here on Earth. There is somehow, by the way, also the, the fact that um, I do understand that, like dome effect that they talk about that that the Earth is flat, but there's a dome around it. Yeah. Okay, I understand what you mean by dome. Flat no, flat no. Well, the sea is still very nice. The sky is beautiful. The sunsets are perfect, so I don't mind if it is flat or round. No, they they talk about the fact now that it is all overshadowed by whatever. Oh. Yeah. And yes, I do okay. believe that because everybody has to control everybody all the time or thinks that they have to control everybody. Siri, <sighs> Everything that backs up a uh, globe Earth is theory. It's nothing has been proven. Roll, you you know it's immediately who's the Dutch guy in here. It's Roll. <laughs> like Roll, I'm thinking the same with you. But uh, look up on Google Earth. Yeah, <laughs> then you can spin around the ball. Is it to be distracting your eyes? I'm trying to look on uh, the video there, and my eyes go like this. Everywhere. It's dots, 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 dots. That's annoying because I had a client today and it was late at night and he was wearing his ray and sunglasses. It was sitting. What are those? Choose. No, that's what they say. I'm, I don't know. What are those? Which yeah. ones are those? <laughs> what are those? I like you guys. Just one thing. What are those? Yeah, which ones? My shoes. These ones. Are the boots there? Anyway, I hate your hat. You're driving the shirt that you're nice. Okay. Yeah, if I could see, I would read, but I cannot see. The letters are like this. Oh, what? Because because I got I got the question earlier like which um, YouTuber you like and I liked Shake Shake Carl who cheated on his wife but that's the brand that they have. It's a nice very big circle. It's round, very round. Your girl all this time. That got ADM birds trip to calls. No, I might actually put turn on some music. 
<laughs> Maybe I'm fangirling. I don't mind it. <laughs> now I understand the response of Charlie also, because Roald is like, I'm fangirling, but you two are best vloggers. Thank you very much. I hope the rest also will start believing that. Um, I do love making those vlogs, by the way. I really do love to make it. Yeah, to be honest, I'm, we lived together now for three years. Four and how long? Long enough. Three years. Yeah. And I've never seen him so happy and passionate about something that he does. Of course, he's very happy when he is like, not happy, but he's very enthusiastic always when we get a new job about drawing or something. He's uh, very much like, oh, yes, we can do this, and we can do that, and we can make it like this, and that, and that. But it is something that is fading slowly. I mean, you're very enthusiastic in the beginning, and then you're like, okay, it's not a drawing. Except for blocks, I mean. Yes, when you do this, you're like, yes, I like this. And then at the end, you can watch it over and over. It's a, it's a thing also because at the, in the vlogs I can do what I like because I really do what I like. I make what I like. I make the vlogs like I like to see them. I like to see them even better, but I do not have the tools right now to do that. Um, and the thing is that, I don't know, I do not like to get that much along with the trends. I do like the challenges sometimes that some people do, uh, but I like to give them my own twist also. It is... I don't know, I like to show my, I also, I'm not narcissistic. I do not like watching myself at all because I hate editing, to be honest. I hate making myself look better in the vlogs than I'm actually at. Because, of course, we also fight, but you don't vlog about that, right? What? Nah, never. <laughs> but I think every healthy relationship has that, so. Of course we fight, because I'm always correct, and you're always right. Uh, Charlie's asking. Oh <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> So Charlie is asking if he can call you Milonza. I don't mind. I think that's a cool name for Ilona for the vlog, like Milonza. But what, 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 what nickname what would you Milonza? give me? Milonza is like Marcia and Ilona. Milonza. Ah, I like Milonza, by the way. I wish, actually. You know what? It would be funny. I, would, I think it would be funny if um, we could, like, if I would one time, like, hit 50 million just like PewDiePie, and then we do, we'd do the Flat Earth and we make a video on that. Because that would fun. shake that would shake the world, I think. Actually, if like fifty million people are being like snapped into the thinking of having a flat Earth, that will be that will be good. Macho man. Oh my God, who said that again? I I have had that name in the past. Someone called me like Macho Man. I I'm, I don't get. I don't intend to be like that. Macho. Yeah, Macho. I told you that you You got no. Yeah, but in Greek, like a little bit sometimes. I don't know. I just, I, I just don't. It's maybe the way of uh, the, how I act or something. Like I move and talk a lot, and it's also I'm distracted all the time, and uh, I don't care that much about what other people think. Sometimes, sometimes because when I vlog, for example, on the streets and I walk around like this, <laughs> I really do sometimes feel like oh, they're all looking at me, and it's really very weird. But you just have to get used to it, and it's also because I'm still just walking around with a phone and a stick. Yeah, it's I mean, different. it's different if you're holding a big camera with a microphone because then you look more professional. Stop. No, and then they just stop and they're like, oh, can I take a picture? Yeah. Can I take a picture with you? Who are you? Are you famous? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not your man, you're sure. See, Nicholas, the thing is that what is the truth again? You, you try to convince me of a truth that anybody else also tries to convince me of another truth. And to be honest, why should I waste my time of thinking about that? And uh, just do what I think is my best truth. I mean, if everybody does that, then the world would be a lot happier than to push other people and thinking other things. Because then you're doing exactly the same what the big group is doing right now. Right? I'm motivating. <laughs> I, I wish I could motivate myself, though, sometimes, Shane, because right now with the phone, for example, it's very hard to motivate yourself. But I was about to cry. To be Ilona, yeah, that's yeah. the thing. I believe in the fact that you live in the present and you do not, you, yesterday you lived and tomorrow you will live. And if you live in the present, you will not have to worry that much. So, uh, United Nations, there, there's a lot of uh, controversial stuff around the United Nations as well. Because how united are they? Shane can help me. Mar Martin can be rumpy. Why? Oh, don't even say, Charlie, what? that Martin can be rum. What's that? I don't know, Martin Trump? Ah. 
I don't know. I, uh, sorry if I say something wrong for some people here, but I do not like Trump, to be honest. Um, I think there should be a, it's, it's a puppet. Yep, I agree on that. I, I'm not too much into politics, politics, but I do. He may be a good businessman, but he's not a good leader. Yeah, the businessman, yeah. Also, as a leader, I think you should walk front and take the rest with you and uh, not tell the rest where to go and stay on your ass in the same position. That's, uh, that's, from Loda. <laughs> Mixing up, guys. <laughs> yeah, I like my name. For Greece, it's very rare. Well, okay. When I introduce myself, it's too difficult for them because they can never understand. They're always like, huh? Ah, what? So Ilona, Lona, Elona, Alona. They can never understand that it's Ilona. What? Mom and Jordan. <laughs> Tell your story. But uh, I like it because in Greece I can say that there are like two maybe or three with the same name. It's convenient. Nicholas, if you hit me up with those uh, people that all support Flat Earth people and they su subscribe to this channel, I might actually turn into one as well. <laughs> yeah, because then I actually no, then I turn into a slave just like that. That's the thing. All presidents are public. Uh, almost everyone in history was Freemason, and that's also a positive in some ways. Ilona, don't read Mark and say, Top of the morning, see you, laddies. <laughs> Ilona, don't read. If you write it that way. I will not read, okay. If you Martin, write, if you say. write yeah. <laughs> Top of the morning, see you, laddies. My name is Jack Hello, Jackie. My name is Mark Jogan, and I like blogging. A lot. I'm alone in my Um <laughs> Intros of other YouTubers. Other YouTubers. I, I just start always. Good morning, afternoon, or evening. What is up? My name is Marta. Thank you for watching this live stream, actually. And uh, that's that just a thing that I like to say because it gets me very nice, pumped up. If you would wake up every morning and you would say, Good morning to yourself or something. It would pump you up way more for the entire day. It gives you a boost of energy. However, if I did not have my breakfast yet, I'm not that happy. In the first hour when he wakes up, he's horrible. You cannot talk to him, you cannot walk around him. I love you. Oh. I look like a middle aged Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> I think actually, no, I'm, I'm uh, the same. Uh, Jack's also about to hit uh, 30. So we're about the same uh, same age. I've, I've been subscribed to him since he hit 150K. I remember that video. The 300K, actually. So I remember that video, 300,000 subscribers. And I checked all the videos before that because he really grew very fast. No, less actually, 100K. 100K, that's when I subscribed. Anyway, he can tell me later anyway. I don't know. I shouldn't make Jacksepticeye the title here as well because then you get way more views. Milonza is a Barbie Marcia. So you're a pretty girl. I know. <laughs> I should sit like this. Now I'm more like a hobbit. Anyway. Uh, what are we going to do for the rest of the live stream? I, again, for people that are watching that are interested in about this or want to see it or whatever, we just had uh, almost 200 people in here in the live stream and they all mm -hmm. tried to convince me. Yeah, I just saw it like rise to 200 and then they posted something and it dropped down again. Um, mm -hmm. I hope that all those people did it from Reddit or something that they came in just to hit this live stream. Odd reality is a 24 7 live stream. Um, does he sleep in his live stream as well? <laughs> Would not want to see that. If I get a girlfriend again, I would troll so much. <laughs> um, be careful because the troll here is Ilona most of the time, to be honest. Ilona is a troll girl and she cannot wait for the Dutch guys to come over actually because uh, they're my best. They always say like like your your good friends, they are a they how do you, how did Mark say that? Good friends make fun with you, but but your best friends make fun of you, something like that. And, and Ilona, especially Ilona and Mark, they like they like hook up together against me sometimes, and it yeah, does turn into bullying sometimes to my feeling because it doesn't stop. But yeah. yeah but you know that they love you. Yeah, I know that you love me. So. But still, 
bullying is not nice. I um, think that this uh, should be the end of the live stream. We give it another nine minutes, and then uh, we'll hit it because then it hits 11 o'clock here, and then we've been live streaming for one and a half hour. I'm actually very satisfied about how this went, so maybe we will do it again. Every Sunday? Every Sunday. Robert, what do you think? Every Sunday live stream? Just give it a bit more. Milonza looks very innocent, but you can see the evil. <laughs> Tell me about it. Oh. Tell me about the evil inside Ilona. <laughs> Richard from Boston. Too. The funny thing is, Nicholas, that everything that you say are Americans right now. I want to. Uh, I wonder. Uh, nice to meet you too, nice Donald. Too. Mm -hmm. I still didn't read, by the way, the comment where your last name was from. I thought it was India, but maybe I walked off that time. Uh, is it there for for a reason that all those things come from America or something? The research about flat Earth that I'm thinking of. That I, because I see a lot of posts of people that are living in America, American names. I do not hear any like Austrian researchers or. Uh, because they have, of course, the biggest ring in Austria and Switzerland, or Switzerland or Austria, where they uh, part of, where they speed up the particles to create black holes if necessary, or from Oregon oh. to USA. Cool. I just got the question, like, if I want to move to the USA, and yes, I would actually want to if Trump was not your president. <laughs> so that's why I actually I prefer Canada also, because gun control and stuff like that. See, I'm, I may be a little bit of a wuss with that, but I think that guns wouldn't be necessary to take a stick. This as well. Um, I also see that the Netherlands, for example, because I'm Dutch, I see that we that the Dutch people are very much Americanizing. That's what I call it a lot of times because we have uh, Kentucky Fried Chicken, we've got a McDonald's Shell, uh, we've got all the big American companies actually. They are located for tax profit in the Netherlands as well, and then they. Ah, it's, see it's a name. dome. Do you see your name? Life, oh, okay. life at beach full time. Here as well. I live in Greece right now. That's for a reason also. <laughs> Are you fully Georgian or also Greek or Russian? I have no idea. <laughs> I was born in Georgia. My dad is a Greek. My mom is a half Georgian, half Greek, half something. I don't know. We have a lot of our blood, so I'm a bit of everything. I guess. And that's fully Georgian or fully Russian or I have a bit of everything. Neither, neither do I. I think actually that I would like to do the blood test one time to check out where my DNA comes from because uh, if you check my, I'm not that white as most Dutch people uh, and my dad especially, my dad is tall like a Dutch guy but he's very dark haired. He started blonde and I was almost like, okay, gray, black. But uh, Greece is a very cool place. Yes, Too bad it is a very, a very strong economical crisis. Also that. Mm -hmm. uh, because Greece would be a way better place actually if it was not in an economical crisis. But still, we see here, for example, very strongly, like if you have power, you have money. And uh, that's the thing that in Greece is not very nice. But the country is super. The people are in general paradise. super. Yeah, it's, in, in a lot of places, it's like paradise. Greece is a very beautiful corner of uh, Earth, I believe. Because the Balkan. Yeah, yes, yes. Because it's very, very nice weather. You have almost summer all day long, uh, all here too. And also the people, yeah, it's very different here. It's more open. It's not like I travel not a lot, not a lot, no. But no, I've been in many places, but. You don't see that people are that much open. Here it's normal to see like this with a completely stranger, you know? And it's very open and it's very natural and I don't know. It's true. And it's it's also a little true what Donald says about the fact that uh, EU got a country by the boss. It's not that much EU because they are actually telling the, the central bank to support the country more, but what does it help if you put gas and put gas in the gas tank that has a leak? So that's what's going on right now. They're Putting money in all the time, and yeah, and uh, but all, to be honest, I do not know your last name, and maybe we should not say it also like out loud immediately. But 
Ich behaupte Deutsch, also ich habe keine Ahnung, ob du auch Deutsch singen kannst, aber nach einem. You say it's not much better, I know, but it is, it's got different issues in the USA. I The USA is colonized a lot, and here the, colon, the colonies that, that came to the USA to build the USA, uh, that killed all the Indians and the original inhabitants of the country, um, the they, they come from this side of the world, so most of what I understand is. So we should be able. To, we should actually be able to set. Uh, oh yes, wait. If we talk about debt, then Greece is not even that much in debt. It's not much for the system that is not working correctly. That's the thing about it, also, right? Why? Well, uh, I do not usually get my my blogs this deep into this kind of stuff, but now you understand also that I do love talking about this. I can talk hours about this kind of stuff. Yeah, yeah. Do it. What do you think? If you're flat around. I don't care as long as there is food. <laughs> Nobody's touching my belly. <laughs> uh, okay, so guys, oh, wait, yeah, I saw it. I did see it, but I'm not going to repeat it. I'm sorry. I will not in the live stream. Because uh, also, if some people might have noticed actually that uh, here in Greece, in the Netherlands, I would grab the camera and I would just walk in everywhere. I would not care because people are used to CCTV or in cameras everywhere. Somehow, because time is a little bit back in a lot of places here, well, people just now start really paying with cards. And still, not all the car all the stores have card machines like where you can pay by card. But they do that because you cannot get money in cash. You're not allowed to take more than 500 euros for your. Also, that that's also why how the EU and the central bank grab some by ball because of capital controls. So I cannot buy from eBay, which I no. used to do a lot, but now, so I now you can just not allowed. a little bit. We can buy toothbrushes from uh, the yeah. airport. No, I can't. Oh, okay. I can at least because I still have a Dutch uh, account. So that's also how some kind of be will buy the balls. Uh, yeah. But yeah, like you say, also USA is not much better. There's a lot of poverty and not a lot of good healthcare. And that's the same here in Greece as well. In a lot of, but healthcare is, when it works, it works very good. The doctor is super. It depends. If you go to private, uh... The hospital is very, very, very good. If you go to um, the hospital in your work, no, it's okay. It's what I say. It's very good. <laughs> very good range here. We just love to be grumpy about everything. Your sister's in Athens. Oh. Well, the, the last one having a coffee with us is not a problem. If you're close, but be on a shame uh, or go up or whatever. Uh, if you, uh, if you, Want to come to Greece? I advise you to fly with Ryanair from Dusseldorf to Thessaloniki because the tickets are like 40 euros or cheaper sometimes. We flew for 100 euros. 99 euros per person. We flew for 100 euros, less than 100 euros, 90 euros. We flew uh, together back and forth uh, to the Netherlands. Well, to Dusseldorf at least. So it depends on where you're living from and where you're leaving from. We are also having another prison learning. Um, they are going to in Belgium as well, shall we? So money, we know we know about how to practice mm -hmm. with money. Uh, money runs the world, so uh, but it doesn't mean that you should not be able to travel at all. Mm -hmm. There are also train decks, so you can check you can check out because they're younger. There are also like these train tickets that take you all the way through the Netherlands, Germany, Austria, down to the Balkan uh, countries, and you can take like a week journey with by train, and that's very cool. My phone is on the floor. I know, I didn't do that. You can do that. Uh, when we are going to be in the Netherlands, I'm not sure. November. Well, maybe in November somewhere, yeah, but still, I don't know. Uh, we don't go to like the Rostov that much. Mm -hmm. It's a busy area for that well, I mean, why would we then go there? Amsterdam, Amsterdam. Actually, we should go there because we have to face a lot of people next time we go there because a lot of Greeks actually leave <laughs> from there to the Netherlands, from leave from leave Greece and go to the Netherlands. So we have to face a lot of people right there. Um, yeah. Yeah, we should find out. But I think oh, we will be in London. Very good. Cheese. Itty bitty. I think it's way more interesting to see uh, you come over here, so you have a little bit of holiday as well, and you'll be in the vlog as well. With nice weather. With, with mm -hmm. nice weather, yeah. That's your sister. 
It is uh, one minute one minute past eleven, so I'm going to say if you like this live stream, please leave a like down below. I want to thank everybody, uh, especially the subscribers, uh, for joining this, for the new subscribers that joined us, for the Flat Earth people, uh, for <laughs> I want to thank everybody for joining us. Um, I don't mean, no, Shane, I don't mean like, uh, well, I can travel or whatever. I, I don't mean like that. There are special tickets that you can get for like traveling up and down. It's a uh, Euro pass. Uh, Donald Duck. Um, we'll see you next week. Yes, because next week I'm going to have on Sunday again a, a, a live stream. Wait, hey. are you guys here? Yeah. Oh, no, no, they're going to do that, right? It's going to be, it's going to be a hectic probably one. Maybe it's going to be a hectic one. Okay, maybe next week we will not do it if the guys don't want it because it's a bit like if you are hosting people, you cannot expect them to want to do everything we do. You donate? What do you donate, Donald? I'm very curious because right now my vlogging camera is dead. So, see next month. Also, I'm fine with that. Whenever you want to come back, that's also fine with that. But next month, today is the 1st of June, so that's uh, in 30 days next month. Look, finally! <laughs> At the last moment, but I want to leave. Brooke is also here. Brooke's also a subscriber from like a long time ago. Okay, now we have to stay a little bit. <laughs> It would it wouldn't be fair for fair for Puck to talk about it. Is it Puck or Puck? Do you know what that means in Russian? No. I'm very sorry. That means Puck. Puck. <laughs> sorry, Puck, but Ilona just starts making really fun of you. So that it, I didn't know that Puck in, in Russian means Puck. I'm uh, sorry. <laughs> and, and, and what was the other one? Yo. Yeah. Yes. So um, there, there are a lot of. Oh, my question to you is, would you back me up if I did a fundraiser? Yes, of course. If I had the money to do it, <laughs> because if I wouldn't do a fundraiser if I had money. If I did have money, I would not do a fundraiser to buy a camera and actually make something out of the vlog. Bark, no fart. Escape. <laughs> we had once visitors here, and they were talking about a friend. Yeah. Uh, whose name is Yo. Yeah. Which means in Russian fuck. Yeah, it means it, it means screwing in the Yeah, screwing, exactly. That's your question? What no what, your my Are question you? I don't understand, sorry uh, that's, that's you. your silly. Yes, thank you. My question to you is would you back me up if I did a fundraiser? That's what ah, my fundraiser, yes. I, w I want, I'm thinking of doing a fundraiser, a little fundraiser, because uh, like I said, we're in Greece, capital controls, Ilona is the only one with a steady job right here. I'm trying to make the best out of the vlog. And um, uh, my parents advised me to maybe do a, something like an Indiegogo kind of website, but not really because they take so much percentage. And uh, so maybe that I mm -hmm. could have some backers to get a little amount of money to make something out of it and give something in return, of course, because I do not want to just ask for money. I want to give something in return. Um, do it. I will. I will actually for next. I will look into it. What it's actually going to take to do it. Um, it I don't know. Is it strange to just give your bank account number in that case? No, I, I'm not going to do that because I, I think it's strange. Fundraiser. Um, I know some Dutch sites actually that say that's a very good fundraising site, uh, and it's just I'm just talking about like 500 euros, just talking about 500 euros. That's two months rent here, uh, right? Or for some people actually that's almost uh, what? 500 euros. No, for some people that's two months payment. Yeah, they may back you. Uh, <laughs> thanks, Shane. I, I will definitely look, okay, I will look into it and I'll let you know if you all want to join again on Sunday in the live stream. Right now we have seven viewers. It's very nice if all those seven people would do something. I'm not asking or begging for money, but I want to do something back. So if you have a nice idea that I can do back to you, I'm, I make 3D drawings, I uh, can make videos or whatever for camera phone. Well, a phone, to be honest, I can get a cheap one for 50 euros. I do not pay attention to that if I can get a good camera. That's the thing. And I'm not going to go for the most expensive uh, 
Sony Alpha 6500 uh, series. It is a little bit of bad shame. It is a little bit. To me, it sounds a lot like this. It's, yeah, of course. It's just like sitting at Lidl and saying, like, I, I need to have a house, so give me. You know, that's how, that's what it feels like. I've never needed to do this. I've always been working hard to get my money, and that's how I made it. Um, but I I maybe we can make a song for people, sing a song, or uh, send them a postcard from Greece. Send, maybe we can send you products from Greece uh, in exchange. I heard something about that. I would like to shut the free. Reach me, sorry. Okay. I would love to send you, Donald. I, would, I, I make blogs here. I mean, I can send you whatever you want to. Um, the, the fact is just that if you want shots, just pictures, you should de definitely check out Google Images. <laughs> what? <laughs> get, 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 get. Google Images is a very good, uh, a very good source. Not mm -hmm. trying to be funny, but no, I, you know, it's not working, is it? Nope. You're not funny. I, I know. You always have to, you, you are always backing me up in that one. If I say, yeah. like, I'm not funny, I'm like, mm -hmm. Oh my god, you're so funny. <laughs> anyway, so I think we can. Yeah. Um, no, again, I will look into it. Again, Shane, yes, if you say also about, like, is you're, are you understand about the banking part, again, if I put my bank account underneath there, I think it just like saying, hey, here's my money, uh, take it, would be awesome, of course. Uh, but that's why I want to do a fundraiser thingy so I can actually promise also the backers to, to back me up that I can offer them something. Because just like here, when I made the subscribe, when I uh, hit 100 videos that I did the thanking of subscriber thingy, uh, where, sorry, look, I did not mention you, but because you're um, not showing that you're subscribed to other people, I didn't name you. Uh, as well as Shane, I, no, Shane, no, I did it. actually call you. Oh, you're both in shock. Donald, we're in Greece. <laughs> <laughs> I can show you by my Greek uh, coffee. Um, yeah. I was talking about the there's no, no, it wasn't. Yeah, I can actually love it for my project. <sighs> I do not know that song, to be honest, but I know a lot of songs. I can sing for you guys. You keep saying shame. Uh, I want to change. <laughs> okay, I will keep you. I will tell, uh, name you Roald, but it's for other people to understand the comments because they might not understand that you, Roald, are Roald because your name says shame. And I don't think that's easy. You have to go to Google Plus to change your uh, username, actually. And I might actually change the channel also a little bit by name and lookout, but you'll see that in the future. Uh, yeah, because I, I do branding, I do help with colors as an interior designer, and I do a little bit of branding for that kind as well. And I like to do graphical design as well. And the fact is that when I do that, I should also do it good for myself, right? And I took yeah. something very easy from the beginning because I just uploaded a video, made a little channel. And then it like started. Slowly. The first video that you made, I had no idea it was about to go on YouTube. And also, I've been taking last time. I've been taking the videos from the beginning. Thanks, sir. No. Um, I checked the videos from the beginning, and I saw such a big difference. First of all, we were both very fast. Yeah, that's one yeah. one thing. I don't know if you've noticed, but if you if you change if you compare the last video, for example, my face, and you compare it to the video where we went swimming, I was like blown up in my face. Yeah. And right now, I can see my my bones and my muscles in this part again. Okay, I did get very thin, but. Uh, first thing is the second thing is that at the beginning I was not talking. I was just talking with this behind you. Now I'm more myself because it took too much to do with it. Great. <laughs> Um, but uh, I want to say that the first video, when he, when uh, it was snowing, and he was like, let's go out to take a walk and show our parents how it is in Volo. So I was like, yeah, sure. And I had no idea to go on YouTube and to start making the videos. Yeah, that was the first vlog. And since yeah. then, it actually started growing a little bit. It's funny, oh. because the people that I read the messages by now, even Donald, even you, even while you just joined in, uh, I mean, Brooke and Shane, they have been like subscribers from the beginning, and I I get 
an average view of like 100 uh, views per video, which for me, if you have 100 people around you, that's a lot of people actually. It is so, nice. It was nice, yeah. yeah. And, it's, it, and you get a, some kind of satisfaction. And what you just said as well about like um, the fact that you get motivated, comments and stuff like that, they motivate you as well. And it helps when a person tells you you did a good job. And that's what I like as well. So, yeah, it really, it, it really is motivating to do this. And if there's been a couple of videos that are not being watched at one, I'm like, what am I doing wrong? Should I do better, more my best, or should I just stop and then? Or the design. Or the, yeah, there's someone that hit, hit the dislike button all the time consistently, which I don't mind, but it, it gives a little bit of a strange feeling, yeah. you know? I know that there's like an, a minute long commercial in front of it. I wish it was just every time five or 10 seconds, not much more, or that you just can click through it. Yeah. But that's YouTube, that's not me that wants to do that. I, I do, I can't change it in the settings, but Again, like I said, I'm just a small thingy, and if I want to grow, I need to do that as well a little bit. Sadly enough, when I'm a bigger YouTuber, I don't even need to use, like, I can use whatever music I want to, because I love music. I'm a very big fan of music. And sometimes I would love to throw in some Ed Sheeran, for example, with a good song, um, something like that. Well, how many times you were in the car and you were singing? Oh, yeah. We're going crazy in the car over music, and then, like, why, you know? Moana, the movie oh. Moana. <laughs> we're driving last time from the supermarket and we had that song, You're Welcome. Yeah. And, you know, we're driving a small Jimmy from his parents. And we're standing at the traffic light still. And the windows are open and you could hear the entire neighborhood. The song from the car and the Jimmy goes like this. Yeah. <laughs> That was funny. And, yeah, okay. Uh, Roll says, now, if you're successful, if you're successful, you're getting haters no matter what. Ignore that dislike mark. I know, yeah. but that's also, it's not comparable because if you look at a 12 million subscriber YouTube ch a YouTube channel, he gets maybe around like a thousand dislikes compared to 30,000 likes. And then he still has like an average of 2 million views that he knows of people that really do enjoy watching his videos. So, yeah. You're now a very good blogger editor. We need to help you to find to a new fabulous camera. I'll be, by the way, share your channel. You're an angel book. Thank you. <laughs> it is it is this see those kind of things are like I cannot disappoint you guys anymore. That's why I have to upload every day. And that's also why today I felt very bad when my phone did not start the first time. Oh, I had such a nice video. Are we, yeah, and, and going for a swim and everything, I want to show you, like, look what we did, and you should come join us. You know, I want to take you along a little bit for that. It's a little bit strange then. The weather was so nice last Sunday, and it was so beautiful, and you could see the corners of the sea through the what? Third cross, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so beautiful. <laughs> Hashtag get Martin and Ilona a better camera. <laughs> it was very easy to read because I know exactly what you're talking about. It's funny that you're, you keep talking about our vlog while yeah. he does everything. No, people like you. you they very, don't know me, that's very, why. <laughs> I, think, I think if I look at the vlogs, Ilona has a very high likability rate. I mean, she's always laughy and happy and funny. and. I cannot always be that much happy or funny. I do complain sometimes in the vlog, and I know it's not, but that's Dutch maybe, like to openly complain about stuff. And I see a lot of uh, bloggers and YouTubers that do not complain in their videos. And I think that gives a fake reality. Uh, the thing is, Brooke, I want to stay consistently every single day, to have something uploaded every single day, you know? It, it would be fun to just say, uh, I have been uploading since the 6th of January every single day in the year, not skip the day. And then you can just say, look, okay, from the 1st until the 6th, I'm going to have a holiday. That would be cool. That's what my idea is now. Exactly. That's also, Ilona wants to do, so we can continue at least our job that we do, like the design part. But now it also became very important yeah. to the vlog also, for example, when we go to a little village here in Greece, not everywhere is internet. That's going to be a big mistake because now it also takes about an hour and a half for me to upload the 10 minute vlog. Yeah. Well, it's still in 1080p. So can you imagine? I, I cannot even start vlogging with a 4K camera. I, 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 Today's vlog is going to be uploaded in three days because of internet connection. <laughs> and then still, you have to be, have to be very uh, thankful for the fact that you have yeah. internet. 
because our internet connection drops out so many I times. remember when we first moved here and we we did not have our internet connection yet and we were streaming from somebody from the neighborhood. And then we started with once upon a time. We, we got we got it from from a house across the street, the street yes, actually. Yes, so you right. had to like stand outside on the corner of the yes. need to actually get some signal and <laughs> But we were addicted to once upon a time. We just found out the series so we had to watch it. So we were standing all the way outside on the balcony. I was hanging in Greece to get connection, but in the end it did not work that well. So at the middle of the night, it was about 12 o'clock or something at night, mm -hmm. we drove all the way to the store because I have Wi-Fi there and I know the password and everything, so I have connection to download three episodes, drive back to watch it. <laughs> yeah, that's... Oh yeah, we went to the store yeah. to download it. I forgot that story. See, those are kind of things, nice things also for the vlog to show Chris. Maybe it's not for everybody, but we had a lot of times actually that people ask immediately like what's your Wi-Fi code and in the Netherlands everybody has will find Wi-Fi, I don't know. The vlog is about your life. There are always problems and nice things. That's life. That reminds me of a song that is very highly copyrighted. <laughs> but it's like, like that's life. Uh, anyway. Um, yes, it is about life, the vlog. Uh, but my vlogs I do not want them only to be about my life because it becomes like a, a little bit uh, a little bit egocentric and a little bit narcissistic. Uh, it is our life also where we live together in this house. When you talk like this, I think that you love me. I do love you. <laughs> of course really? I love you. Of course I love you. Let me love you like a dog. <laughs> uh, <laughs> But yeah, a vlog, a vlog is about your life, but in this case, a vlog is also about Bolo and about life in Greece and living between Greeks, among Greeks, as a Dutch guy who's totally been raised differently as everybody else here. And that gives, in my opinion, what Greeks all say, very good content, content. The only thing is just that it needs to be shared and go out there. And there's still like a, I think at least if I just do it like that, 70% that does not speak English in Greece. Yeah. Especially in people that, or there's not even like 30% that watches YouTube. There's only 30% of the youth that watches YouTube. That's what I mean. Like from from zero up to 35 years old, they only watch YouTube. As far as I know, in the Netherlands and America, everybody knows about YouTube. So I know you have to go work at Hugo at all. So uh, we'll see you at the next one. We'll keep it short. We stayed a little bit longer for quick as well because I thought it was a little bit sad to just say like why after all those uh, flat earth people, mm -hmm. Donald is still here. Uh, we've got still three other people that are watching as well. I think the Yashua will now have left me. Yeah, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna say some stuff in Greek right now, so maybe they will reply. Anistelnas, the Apogea for now, Sexero Rock, Graphica to Commons, Graphica TV Pla, and Exerum Camis, or Tim is the Mazimas. Sero Rock, Etsy. Who said that? 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 ATS video editor. You do not want to know how much that program <laughs> breaks my balls. When he's editing, you can hear cut, cut for the Take it easy on those ways. <laughs> but rest of Doing the things. See you on Sunday again, probably. And tomorrow on the vlog. Uh, yeah. <laughs> good night. <laughs> I was really about to leave already. Um, what were we talking about? About this wearing that. Oh, about the about <laughs> the editing, yeah. The editing, well, I'm trying to do my best. I never edited any videos and I get quicker at it and I hope to edit soon again in Premiere Pro so I can use some filters as well so I can make the color stand out a little bit more. Only in like B-roll, only in like nice pictures so the pictures look better. And um, Chow. I think Chow mm -hmm. is written C I O C I. A O. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's that like chow chow, like a dog. But the editing right now is being done very simply in ABS. I cut off all the footage. I cut out my most of my uh, 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 and anyways, those kind of words. Anyways, whatever. Whatever. Okay. So, so long story short. Let's do it. Ciao. Yeah.
that's that's what I cut out a little bit because it, it gets repetitive maybe. Like one hour is repetitive. And it's also for me. I mean, like if I watch back my vlogs and I'm seeing myself say the whole time like uh and uh then I'm like, no, cut that out, whatever. <laughs> Um, what, when you when you walk around here, when I walk around the street, for example, also I take minutes when people little, like really like start like staring at me and like what? Hitfilm Express is also a good program. Yeah, I just found it out because I checked um, Darius's channel, Deeper Darius, and he just showed me also about the fact that it's uh, decent actually. There's a free version and a paid version, and it looks just like Premiere Pro, but it comes for a little different on free. It does not work. You know what the fact is though that I have since I started using ABS right now I've quickened it, and uh, even though it breaks down on me all the time, I know exactly when it will break down if I like. It's convenient because you know it. Yeah, because I know it right now, and uh, I can open the files only with ABS. If I start using HitFilm Express right now, then you will see automatically that they I will save it in different kind of files, and then when I change later maybe to Premiere Pro to a paid version. Then I need to save it as those kind of files again. So it's a little bit difficult. The, the project yeah, files. Right? I until now I've saved all my footage, all of it. I mean I have one terabyte. So Jupiter. I do not know what Jupiter is to be honest. I get I base my opinion a lot of on the American and and in general European review channels, not just Dutch channels. The Greek channel. Take it serious. Shout out to Tech Serial, shout out to Panagiot Zafei, shout out to Shout out to Cook, shout out to Rod, shout out to Donald, shout out to Shota, Adela, whatever. Asimenia was still watching a second ago as well. Shout out to everybody like that. No, you're sitting next to me. So? I can shout at you, but not out. Maybe the camera you'll buy would be. Definitely. I would like to have a zoom lens that's not a tele lens, but a little bit bigger angle. Because now I'm really like that to get a decent angle and you can see my arm being all stretched out and like that. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so I would yeah. shout out to Flutter, Ricardo, hey. shout out to Flutter. You're coming all back again, all, all 200 of you. <laughs> and we'll export to it. We'll Of course, and well, I, I, before I use now Avi files because they're a, little, a lot smaller, and I just upload in an 1080p from my phone. So, uh, you gotta, if you could bring back those 200 people, I left my ass off, and I will, <laughs> I will make sure this entire thing becomes like better again. Uh, I like, I, I don't know, I liked it somehow. It was funny. It's funny. Yeah. It, it was weird to see all these comments go like crazy up. But the, the camera that I, I would love to have right now, I'm, I'm join, I joined a couple of giveaways by Chris Winter, also a guy that is like going to give away a camera, and I think uh, Jim McKinnon was giving away a camera again as well, and uh, some DIY channels were giving away a camera. But I always see that they stay within America, those cameras, or Canada in some cases, or oh. South America, but they barely come, they barely give away to Europe. I don't know why that is, but. Here. And I'm, I would love to have uh, something like a DSLR, like a 77D with a decent lens that goes from wide, wide angle to a little bit of a telephoto lens. I would love to go towards the style of Ewan Olsen. Oh, he makes beautiful videos. Only B roll, but still, yeah, keep, my, still keep my own feeling to it, of course. What I like and what you seemingly like as well. That's what I like. Yeah, the thing is that. When we see things here, sunset or rain, it's so beautiful here when it rains. Yeah, and it the doesn't translate. It's different. Yeah, it doesn't translate on the phone. No, it's not getting adjusted at all. No. But okay. again, now we're complaining about the fact. I mean, I do the best. I, 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 I found out on my phone after four years that I have a slow mo version. I didn't know that. I didn't know I, I could record in 120 frames per second. At 720p, I did. you did. I didn't know, but somehow she didn't tell me. Uh, I didn't think about that. <laughs> <laughs> I well, I'm, I'm, I've been checking on Mark Plus as well, like uh, a 5600D. Did you try to turn on your phone? Crowdfund is a nice platform, and then people with too much money also not there. 
oh, I know about those crowdfunding sites. You've got angel investors that think like, okay, you're good. I give you a thousand. It happens. But have you also seen how many people are on crowdfunding pages? And did you also know that crowdfund pages take a lot, a large percentage of what you actually do uh, for the payment system, for all that kind of stuff? Uh, in, in in exchange, of course, you get the promise that you receive something back. But I don't know. I, I don't know. I, I have to look into it. Indiegogo or um, uh, Kickstarter will not work. Indiegogo could work, and there are some other like small fundraisers. GoFundMe. Did you try to turn it on? No. Actually, shall we try to turn it on in the vlog right now? Yeah. Or in the vlog. Rick, we're going to try, and Donald wow. and everybody that's still there. Three viewers. <laughs> Thanks for staying with us. Uh, I'm going to put together my phone again. So, you know, what am I going to do? They're going to look between your legs. No. Okay. They're going to look between my legs. So this is the phone. And then I have... Uh, let me check for a second. Oh, no. I have to install the camera first. <laughs> Not out here. What? I had no idea that there were so many tiny little things in that flat phone. But it's such a big phone and it's so empty also. Uh, to, to with lens or so, without lens. Yeah, I, I prefer to get a, a kit though, to be honest, because uh, kit lenses are getting very, very good lately. And uh, they are stabilized most of the time. Most of the time. So, it is very complicated this phone. It, to be honest, no, actually not. It is just a motherboard like PC, but uh, I have been shooting with a Nikon for school all the time, uh, but most Nikons still do not have a flipback screen, or not the correct versions at least, and they're really much more focused still on uh, photography, which is a good thing if you're a photographer, if you're a vlogger, not that much. Yeah, what was happening with that? And also for me, there were like three bikes standing around the corner. But I was happy because people were driving straight. Yeah. yeah. 400 with lens and stabilized. You can be 300. But what in what kind of quality does it report? That's also because if it only reports 1080p at 30 frames per second, uh, I, I need at least 60 frames per second to make a little bit of a slow motion moment if you want that very stable B-roll footage. Yeah, and the screen. So there there are some oops, there are some uh, there are some modern cameras right now. Not too modern. This, by the way. This is the camera that I vlog everything with. Everything right now. That's crazy. It fits between my fingers. It does have a little bit of uh, corrosion right now, to be honest, on the on the socket. But I don't dare to clean the camera, and it was functioning decently, so. 50, 50, 50 frames per second? That's a weird amount for... Uh, you always hear like 60 frames per second or 30 or 24, 23.5 for Americans. Right now it's just a click system that I have to put together. This part of the live stream is getting a little boring. That's also why we only have three viewers, but I like staying it around. Anyway. We're just chilling right now. You're chilling with us. Maybe I should change the title. <laughs> chilling with Martha and Ilona. Uh, but I am going to work out after this. Yeah. Okay. So it's got here. I'm trying to put it in right now. I don't know how clearly you can see it because the video is so grainy and uh, looking at other stuff right now. Man, it would be uh, it would be very nice though if if it would work in this vlog that or in this live stream that the camera is working again. Let's focus for a second. I'm going to do it on my lap because I'm using the table all the way.
You should talk a little bit, Ilona. I'm so stressed right now. <laughs> Why? I don't know. Like I said before, I'm very, very careful with my things. My phone especially has no scratch, not even one. And when he told me that this happened, I was like, oh, I did not even know how to react. Now we're gonna, there's a little cable hanging out here. It needs to hook up the antenna. I've been checking out the web, the Dutch website Marplas because I find a lot of stuff always there somehow. Uh, there are a lot of people offering good cameras, but they want stupid money for it. That's the thing. Uh, I know this, officially this phone will not be worth anything when I offer it, but if I check out other people that offered this phone, then they still want about like 50 euros for it. And I understand it a little bit, but it is also strange that a non-functioning phone is still worth 50 euros. That's one click. That's more two clicks. That's the antenna. Yeah, I've also watched so many videos about the phone and the inside stuff. But it's like, That's also you why YouTube say, helps so much, yeah. Yeah, you can say every single part that is in there, what does it do? What is it for? So, this is the most important one. It's the LED. I've got very sticky fingers, though. Sorry, I'm not looking at any comments, but Ilona is. And that uh, is clipping. I'll find, I'll find a nice one. Yeah, it's not the issue of finding a nice one. It's the issue of being able to afford a nice one. Oh, I, I went today to a, a store that is called Kotsovolos. We'll get back here, by the way, so you can see some faces, which is a little bit more friendly, in my opinion. Uh, we went today to, I went today to a store that is called Kotsovolos because I was looking for isopropyl alcohol to clean the phone. And... The thing is that I did find isopropyl, but I did not. I went to a store called Kotsovolos. It's like media markets that you have. It's uh, like a, a giant offer of uh, mobile stuff and cameras and washing machine, electronics in general. Yeah. This works. This works. Okay. And when I yeah. went there, what? That's his choice. That's yeah. the thing. No, and actually, that's also what I said recently, like about the Zoom Smooth Q, for example, the gimbal that I had. They're not toys. It, it's nice to have them, and it's nice to play around with them, but officially, they're not toys. They're tools for a lot of people as well. In my case, Do that. at the moment that I start working, for example, really for the vlogs, because it has to, it is going to be like life supporting. In that case, you. It becomes a tool. It's not just a toy anymore. Uh, I used my phone in the beginning always as a toy, play games and just take pictures for Instagram and Facebook and all kinds of stuff like that. But now I got so much attached to it as a tool way more and also mentally like so whew, like it's strange. I got you apples. I got you apples. I went to the supermarket, I got some breakfast and some uh, kitchen paper. A little they were not selling I anymore. No, because you just walked in and enjoyed the live stream. Now we're going to put on the back of the phone. But that's not the back, it's just the back plate. And in this case, we might be the machine. You want some? How late is it, Lois? It is uh, a quarter to twelve. It's just an hour later than in the Netherlands. Turning it on right now. My God. You just witnessed this thing turn on. One second. Do not laugh too fast because it also turns off again. The screen just turned off. So I'm, I'm taking it out again. That's weird for us. Yeah, it is a little bit messed up, so I'm, I'm going to take it, I'm going to stop it, uh, start up right now. This is a little <laughs> bit happiness for me. I'm now going to take up, oh my. No, no, don't celebrate too much yet. Do not celebrate too much oh yet. Oh my God. 
Rick, maybe we did not need to talk about cameras yet. However, this fundraiser will actually come if people are interested. Oh no, I was so hyped. Yeah, I was also hyped. <laughs> what is he doing? He's playing with some receipts. I'm going to open it up again. I'm going to clean the connectors a little bit better for the LCD screen. And you should leave it dry. Because and then I'm going to leave it dry overnight even more. Yeah. Yeah, and so I need to open it up again. <laughs> See, it's because of you people that it's really supported. Really, really supported somehow. Do you use what? Rice. 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 Yeah, I use rice. Yeah, and then we cook. Yeah. <laughs> uh, the thing is that with rice, it got into my aux and into some other ports. And yes, I do put it on the rice now and not in the rice, like a lot of people mm -hmm. say. Because the dust of rice is also not that good. It's not it's not conductive, but yeah. That was internal. Okay, so we are back here again. I'm just gonna leave it rest until tomorrow. It's out there with you. So if you, if you want to be hyped again, I'll ask Ilona to record it again as well. So yeah. What do I get? Would you get? Yeah. Would you get? For recording. Uh, a kiss. Um, okay. not, not sufficient in most. Okay. Which one? It is a, a five. It, it's a five-year-old Galaxy Note three, and Mine to is better, be honest, course. this phone has had at least uh, it's, it has been dropped at least once a week. It has been having a, a bumper case and a flip cover around it for about three, four years. Only since I started vlogging, I took it off because it didn't fit the selfie stick holder. Um, or the monopod. Yeah, that kind of bumper face, yeah. but I like the flip covers. And uh, it, it has a 1080p camera and it's a five year old phone and it records, if you hold it steady, super good things. It, it takes amazing pictures. That's the most important thing. No, but I said for our work, we took it. So I said that I would uh, buy a new phone because I also have the same phone. And I said that I would buy a new phone only if it would be a Note. And the only Note that I like it was Note 7. Because it was the only one that would that, that had the, just a little bit better specs than the rest. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The rest are like just like this, nothing changed. Uh, just a camera. It's a very good phone. Hmm? I am so excited about this. You'll see it in the rest. So you quick, I already wanted to say a lot about an hour ago. I want already wanted to say goodbye. You missed the part where uh, we had about. Um. Yeah, we had about like 100 and uh, 200 people in here that came spamming in about mm -hmm. the flat earth, which I don't mind. It was funny in some cases. Um, yeah. But for now, we are going to say good night because it has been a very long day, actually. I woke up together with Ilona this morning, and usually I take like an hour extra. Mm. What? Mm. What? At 10 o'clock I wake up. I wake up at 10. You leave at 9.30 anyway. So... I'm gonna do the outro like I always did because this video is going probably online all the way. If you like this live stream, please leave a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed yet, please hit the big red button on the bottom here, uh, the subscribe button. Um, leave a comment, but the comments have been full about flat earth stuff anyway. Uh, thanks everybody for watching. Thanks, uh, Berg, thanks, Ro, thanks everybody for watching. We'll see you in the next, we'll one. The next one. Bye. <laughs> yeah, now that is not possible actually because I have to hit the stop, of course. But <laughs> thanks for watching. Bye. <laughs>